Okay, hello dear friends. I'm so proud of myself for making this so that I will use less commodity. Anyway, so today we are going to do some uh, uh, mess work. So I have already put my mess problems in the Google slide. We will take picture. This one has already done the picture. Let's do this picture. Okay. One minute, screenshot, and uh, I do not need this much of things. I only need a little bit of this use as small as possible. Okay, that is done. Save to photo. The next problem, I will take a screenshot. And I will work at home, work from home. You have family sound. Okay, done. Save to photo. Another one. This one screenshot. Mm -mm. Sorry, didn't do it. The the button is not so easy to press. Okay, it needs a lot of because I have a very heavy protection. Oh, oh don't go, don't go. I have not yet saved. Saved your things. Where is it? Where has it gone? What is? Oh yeah, I pressed the button. I should put. Uh, Press the top one. Gosh, life is tough for Yang Hai from time to time. Okay, so we will crop it so that we do not use anything, any space that is not useful. Okay, another one. Oh gosh, this is, oh yeah. This is interesting. This pencil is, uh, is not so good for doing this job. So we will not use it for do that job. See, the first one. Good. Oh, this one we have done. Okay, delete it. Delete. Where is the delete one? Go away. Anyway. I cannot find the delete one. I cannot find the delete one. Let's just delete screenshot. Good job. This one. Screenshot. And uh, okay, save done, save this one screenshot. Okay, done, save. Screenshot, ah, teacher, that is myself. Jing, 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 jing. Done, save to photo. Alice, how are you, Alice? So we will do the problem on Procreate because it's much easier to to do some graph work on Procreate. Some friends ask me to do things. Okay, so these are the problems. And uh, we will go to Procreate. Okay, I will choose this one. Okay, I do not need a guideline. Canvas, 
show guideline, drawing guide. No, I do not need drawing guide. Okay, we will add a picture, add a photo, all photo recent added. So we will go from this one. Nicholas. Can you see it? First, let's read it nicely. Nicholas weighs um, four out of seven, four over seven, as much as his father. Nicholas weighs 80 pounds. How much does his father weigh? So for here, we will draw. This is good, good. Okay, so so this is the weight of um, of proportional weight. We divide it into seven parts because Nicholas weighs four out of seven. So this uh -oh, what is going on? Did I erase it? Go to the layer. Uh oh, I cannot find. I must have erased the layer. Okay, if I ha do have erased, oh, I just cannot find it. Ah, here it is. No, not this. What is going on? Do it again. Yeah, when you first do this, there is much more frustration than enjoyment canvas no drawing guide let me see i think i will do a new picture go back okay we will do on this piece of painting okay adding Picture, insert a photo, recently added, so let's read it, Nicholas weighs 4 out of 7 as much as his father, Nicholas weighs 80 pounds, how much does his father weigh? Put it a bit smaller so that we can work here, good, that is good. So we draw everything here. Okay, so we part it into seven parts. Seven parts. How do I do this? If it is seven out of four, it's a, a little bit over the half line I make it. So this will be four, this will be three, and four out of seven is Nicholas' weight. So I will use another color to show Nicholas. One, two, three, four. So this is Nicholas' weight. Nicholas get four parts, and Nicholas is 80 pounds. So this is 80 pounds. 80 pounds have four blocks. So each block, just by seeing it, we know it's 20 pounds, right? And the father takes a seven part. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Here is another 20 pounds, 20 pounds, 
20 pounds. So altogether, 7 times 20 is 20 times 7 equal 140 pounds. And that is how you see it. So word problem, fraction problem, it's very much easier. You just draw it. You draw it and draw a bar model, make it much easier to explain. And uh, this is for Singapore mass. Singapore mass is particularly strong at, uh, at this. Of course, you can use um, algebra. You can bring in, in uh, variables. You can bring in, in unknowns. But fourth grade, third grade, fifth grade, an unknown variable was not yet introduced. Everything is given. You just uh, um, use um, arithmetic to process and logically finding out things. So this kind of picture is very powerful in doing that. Okay, so let's add a layer and we do another one. So this is the layer two. We will add in the second problem, insert a photo, everything from my recent. Okay, Alice. Alice spend, uh -oh, what is going on? Oh yeah, only one finger. Okay, let's read very nicely, comfortably. Alice spent uh, three quarter as much money as Bob. They, if they spent a total of fifty six dollars, how much did Bob spend? Okay, so we move it in smaller. That's like this. This should be good for us to see, right? Okay. So Alice spent three fourths. Now I draw a picture. Uh oh, I'm still in red, but it's okay. Okay, so I draw a picture. Did you remember how I do three and four, the portion? Three is smaller, four is big. It's just a little bit bigger. So here, draw a line, four. Everything is four, everything is even number. You make something right in the middle first and then chop into another two parts. So this is the four one. Now I change another color. So the three one, one, two, three. Alice spent three fourths as much as the money uh, as Bob. Oh, I got it wrong. So we will delete it. Sometimes we are into um, another thing. So let's just leave it. Sometimes mistake is a way for us to learn. So Alice spent three fourths as much money as Bob. We will do like this. This is Bob. Bob spent three, four, fours. Bob spent this much of money. All kind of makes sense. Bob is a boy's name. And Alice spent, please, please. I do not mean that uh, girls cannot wear blue. It just uh, make me easier to draw, okay? Please do not get too political on it. Okay, so this is uh, Alice spend. Alice spend for the whole part. This one we do not use. This is a new one. This is Alice. Bob spend four of four as much as money. And Alice spend only a portion of what Bob has spent. Alice spend three out of four spend this much of money.
And if all of them together makes 56. Can we guess? Seven equal parts. And seven equal parts makes 56. Each part is how many? Each part is eight. Eight, eight, eight. And for Bob, I use blue color. Eight, 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 eight. 七八五十六, seven times eight equal to uh, 56, right? So this is Bob spend money. And this is Alice spend money. Together they make 56. Does it make sense? So this is $32. So Bob spend $32. Teacher did not ask us, but if, but just as a show off, we know Alice spent how much money? Three of these eight is $24. Dollar. Dollar. Right? Not in a rush. Take your time to do this problem. Draw a line. There are times you draw it wrong. Sometimes I intentionally and not intentionally. I didn't erase it because we all make mistakes. Because I am just a, a mistake for person. Uh -huh. Okay, the next problem, let's cover it up. Number two, add a new layer. Some friends ask what uh, the pencil is. This is Apple Pencil, just the normal Apple Pencil. This is from my school, so my uh, my my name was on it, and the the sticker is too thin, so peeled off. So I roll it; otherwise, it's such a sticker. Anyway, so that I differentiate with the other teacher, with others, uh, other students. So I have it. It's a very good one. Okay, and such a good. Uh, good iPad with this uh, low-tech board, but it's very, very functioning. Okay, layer number three, we will add in our problem. Uh, the wrench, add, insert a photo. This time, recent edit, we will add Alice, we are done. Dad. What did that do? Okay, what did that do? Did that did something funny? That puts orange, black, and white Halloween candies in a box. A quarter is orange, one fifth is black, and 21 are red. How many candies does that? Put in the box. Okay, let's move this question a bit smaller. See, this should be good, right? You can still see it. Okay, you press this. I'm put in. This is a going, 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 gone. Yes, it's in it. Okay, that puts orange, white, and in the box. So in this box, a quarter is orange, one six is black, so how many parts it has? Oh, oh, I should connect it. Okay, let me make it straight. That's the the trick of using Procreate. You draw this and hold on, it becomes straightened up. Okay, one fourth is orange and one sixth is black. How much is the how much is the the black uh, is the white one? Because it's in one box, right? It completely in one box. So one box is a complete one, right? 
one fourth and one sixth. Now let's cut into 12 parts. Why do we do it? The least common uh, denominator is 12, right? Six. This is six. This is six. A uh, 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 six out of 12. Six out of 12. Six out of 12. Half. Six out of 12, right? And then we will cut again. This is three here. Three parts. Uh -oh. Not in a rush, dear class. Not in a rush. Did we cut it into 12 part? I know I have cut it into 12 part because I always fold in, fold in, fold in, half it, half it, half it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Of course. So one fourth, one fourth is is three out of twelve equal to one fourth. So that put uh, one fourth is orange. Oh, good. How good is this? I can do. I can do real orange. One fourth. This is orange. One, two, three. This is orange, right? And one six is black. Okay, I will do a black. Black is one six. One out of six is two out of twelve. So two out of twelve. One, two, two out of twelve is black. And the white one, I cannot use white. So let me use let me use this skin color otherwise you cannot see it so these these are white ones and these all together we know is 21 21 into 1 2 3 4 5 6 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 block so each block is three. Three, 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 three. And all together it makes. So we got to know each of this little passion is three. And how many candy does that put into the whole box? So we have three left and three, 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 three. Each one is three, and totally we have 12 little sections, part into 12 sections. So three times 12, so all together it is 36. Da, 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 da. What color do we use? It's a mixed, mixed color, brown is the mixed color. 36 inside the box. Okay, we got it. Okay, the next problem, let's cover it up. Mm, cannot see, this one is. Add up a new layer and we will add some new problem in this layer. Insert a photo, recent add. So this one, we will put in this problem. That is very, very interesting. There is no word because, uh, because mathematics itself is a word. You can see the pattern. And the problem itself is only up to here. But I just keep on adding and uh, make the pattern because I love uh, patterns. Did you see the pattern half? Half of half. Half of half half, half of half half half, half of half 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 half, half of half 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 half, half of half 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 half. Right? So each time is a half of the previous number. So let's add up them together. We do not need even to to stretch it. Let's just put it 
a big bulky letter here. Okay. Going, going, gone, going there. Okay. So you can do from first or you can do from the back. Let's do from the, 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 the top, from, from beginning to the end. You can actually also do from the end to the beginning. It is the same thing. Okay. A half plus a quarter is half plus oh no, half plus a quarter equal to two fourths plus a quarter equal to three fourths. We know it. Oh, I need to put a stronger color. I'm sorry for that. I didn't mean to let you not able to see it. So this result, so the result So the result for the first part, first two number is three fourths. Now we need to add this number to here. So three fourths plus one eighth equal to six eighths plus one eighth equal to seven a's. Ooh, I'm kind of seeing something. It becomes four and three, eight and seven. I guess this will be 15 and uh, 15, 15 over 16. And this could be 31 over 32. And this one could be 63 over 64. Let's do it. Okay, so the three number add up together becomes this. We add this number with the fourth number. 7 a's plus 1 over 16 is 16 and 14. 14 over 16 because then you need to find the common denominator, right? Plus 1 over 6 and I am not even kidding. It is 15 out of 16. Can you see it? I will increase the density of the, the ink, the, 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 the width of the brush, so you can see, okay? So it's 15 out of 16. How good is that? And now we need to add this number, this number with number with number fifths. So 15 out of 16 plus 1 over 32 equal to 30 over 16 plus 1 over 32 equal to 31 over 32. <gasps> I do see the pattern. And the last one 31 over 32 plus 1 over 46 equal to 64. At the bottom, 63 on top. If you continue to do the next number, keep going, 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 will be 1, 2, 7 over 1, 2, 8. And then keep on will be two five six at the bottom two five five on top and keep on did you play that game two zero four eight you all know that number just keep on adding okay so that is this problem we will cover it up you got it so the final result 63 over 64 Ta da red color ta 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 Isn't it funny? Ooh ooh Isn't it funny? This is the magic of procreate. I 
kind of like to play around with it. Okay, another little trick since this page. I draw any jigujiga shape, put your finger here, it becomes square. It becomes square. And then you can edit shape, make into a rectangle, quadrilateral. It becomes all these points. Isn't it fun? You can draw many, many beautiful shapes. And this will be perfect for my geometry class so that I can draw different shapes, the corns, the um, ellipse, the, um, what else do I draw? Corns and the prism, cuboid. I haven't uh, figured out how to draw the 3D figures, but uh, I will. I think uh, this world had so many things. As long as you want to learn and you make some effort to learn, everything is on your finger. Tipa. Add another layer. Okay, so this one, layer number five, we will add a photo and the recently added. This is the problem. So now you can see this problem becomes so much easier. Bob, Bob gave half of his money to his brother. He was quite uh, yeah, a nice guy. Let's just put it this way. A fourth to his sister, and one eighth to his mother, and one sixth of the money to his dad. <sighs> the hierarchy is very interesting. Dad is the least who, who, who? Yeah, I will not say. The big brother is always the most powerful. I know it. He then had two and uh, two dollar fifty left. How much money was in? Gosh, Bob, where is Benjamin? I didn't uh, correct it. Benjamin, how much money did Benjamin has at the very beginning? Okay, now we put a question here. Okay, this is our problem. So, how much money? So, he has altogether one big block of money. No, this is not good. Erase it. Erase it. And I will use blue color. Okay. So he has this much money. He's a rich guy, don't you think so? Why? <gasps> it becomes ellipse created. I didn't mean to create ellipse line. Okay. Oh my God. What is going on here? Do it again. <laughs> that is funny. Funny. Okay. Okay, okay, we will just do this like this. So half to brother, a fourth to sister, an ace to mother, and a sixteenth to father. So all together, as we have already done, uh, erase this one. As we have seen, this is a 15 over 16, right? We just did that exercise. Okay, so we figure out that, and now we need to part this big lens into 16 parts. 8, 4, 2, 1. This is 8 because the total is 16. Half of 16 is 8. Right? Half of 8 is 4. 
two, four. And half of four is two, 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 two. So all together we have sixteen. Yes, and so we have sixteen. No, no, no. Yes, and so we have sixteen. Okay. So <clears throat> all this money are taken, and only. Oh, the clean money is his money. This beautiful green color. Okay, the beautiful green color is his own money. What a gentle guy. What a gentle boy. And this is a two point five dollar. Right? How many do we have? All together, we have sixteen of two point five. Two point five times sixteen equal to five. Times, a uh, times eight. Five times eight. How do I do it? Because sixteen is two times eight. Two times five is uh, two times two point five is five. So equal to forty. So how much money does he have? Forty U.S. dollars. Are we good? Are you still thinking of doing? This is so good. I am so happy. And、uh, in my class, I will do、uh, video sharing with this. This will be so powerful. Oh my gosh! I'm so happy. So happy. So 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 happy. Let's add another problem. Insert another problem. I think you have already fallen asleep. I'm pretty sure. See you later, alligator. Bye bye, fool.